So today we're here to celebrate the groundbreaking uh, for a new project within CD1. This is uh, called New Beginnings. It's a tremendous utilization of uh, what has been vacant space to create interim housing shelter for our unhoused neighbors here in uh, Council District 1. What's exciting about this, 130 people that were formerly homeless here in the fall of 2022 will be able to move off the streets and into housing. And it just is special because these new units here can actually hold up to four people. And they have restrooms, they have a kitchenette, bedroom, a living room. And then there's laundry facilities. If you have a pet, you can bring it on site. And we're just so happy to provide this to uh, this, this community in need. Our on-site service provider will be JWCH, John Wesley uh, Health Centers and they will be able to provide a federally qualified health center approach to people who are currently living here. So they'll have dental services, primary care, as well as behavioral health and general case management services. Well, we're gonna provide whatever it takes to help a person achieve health and healing, as well as uh, help uh, people complete their housing applications and help with their placement into more longer term facilities that are suited to their needs. We have, last count, showed over 60,000 individuals across the county who are unhoused and we need to do everything within our power to assist them. The goal is permanent housing for all of them. This is a way station on that path, but we absolutely need a significant investment in affordable housing in order to end this crisis.